Leading a small force of Hyrulean soldiers, Impa stepped into one of the newly opened portals. The kingdom spread out before her seemed like the Hyrule she knew, yet it was somehow very different. Before long, she realized that they had traveled back to the era of the mythical hero of time. Odd, Impa began her search for the Gate of Souls. She sensed an evil presence on Death Mountain and set out for the ominous peak. And with her came the mysterious Sheik. Alright guys, welcome back to Let's Play Hyrule Warriors. So, in the last episode, we went to Skyloft and, well actually you know, we went past Skyloft into the sealed grounds and defeated Girahim, as well as the imprisoned one. So in this episode, we're playing as Impa, going a bit back in the story over to her area, going to Death Mountain. Oi. I thought all the Chica uh, were dead. Alright, so not only is Zelda here, but she's done something to the Gorons? I'm confused. Wait, you are our enemy now? I'm very confused. And man, did that do damage! Forgot how much I love doing that. Such power. Wait. Oh, oh crap. I remember this about Death Mountain. That's never fun. A boulder attack on the allied base? The boulder keeps. How do you... Alright, I'm just gonna run by everyone, except for you, because I actually want to take you down. To get that material. Now, I'm heading up, and I'm gonna go take down uh, some of the captains around here so that we can actually get some... Actually, now that I think about it, I really like uh, the fact that Navi's here. Actually, Navi, not Proxy or some other fairy. Navi. Navi has good place in my heart. I love Navi. I know most people are like, oh, it's Navi, she's annoying, me, me, me. Shut up. Navi was helpful and Link's only friend throughout his entire troubles. It doesn't matter if you're smart enough to do it. He was ten. Shut up. Not gonna do that yet. Boom! I love doing this water attack spell. And I have that new attack from upgrading... Impo a little bit. That water blast is still awesome. And I've almost killed enough Gorons to take the keep. Or at least to reveal the boss to take the keep. Kill all you. No, that's not enough. There you are. And now I just slash you all in half. Not a problem. You're all so weak by comparison. I leveled up uh, Impa to be as strong as, well, almost as strong as Link was, so I'm a little bit over leveled for this. Doesn't really matter to me, though. I, of course, don't mind the opportunity to show off. Cut all those guys in half. Man, that's a good feeling. Ow. 
All right. Suck up the water and blow them all up. Impa is so freaking powerful, and her weapon's even more powerful than Lynx was that I was using. Suck them all up and blast them all away. And not only that, but it also has a ability on it called Stars that actually increases the uh, amount of stars on weapons I get, so they're actually better weapons. Okay, Deku Baba's dead. Now I'm going in from the top to kill the outpost captain. Suck them and blow them all away. Oh. Towards the allied base? Really? That's awesome, though. I'm loving all the new abilities you get. I'm just kind of in awe of all of them. Because they're really freaking cool. Taking one of them... Going to take the other keep now. Destroy all the Gorons who decide to oppose me. Arrow all these ones. And while I'm at it, might as well run in here and just slash all of you in half. Not a problem by any means. I'm gonna have to come down here later anyways, I think, so... Might as well just head this way and take the keep. Boom! So much power! Arrow all of you. Got you all. Suck up all of you to defeat you all. This is not even a problem. It just makes me feel so powerful. I love how empowering this game can be. It does a good job with that. Kind of wish they all had their own little themes for this because I feel like Link should have hit. That should always be Link's thing. But it's whatever, I guess. Back to back to what's important. Um, I'm gonna head back down there while they're trying to figure out what they're doing. I'm gonna go grab... I'm gonna bull you all up in the process. I kinda wish this outpost captain got all of his health back. Oh. Did the thing fall? I guess it must have. Defeat Daruni already? Alright. Let's defeat Darunia then. Make our way up there. I'm hoping we're not killing these Gorons. I'm hoping we're just knocking them out because I'd feel bad about killing Gorons. I mean, Gorons are freaking awesome. This. Oh, there's Darunia. Man, that guy's a muscly man. He can crush everyone. He's still as loopy as ever. And apparently now has the bigger on hammer that is currently on fire. What are you doing here, Darunia? I thought you were supposed to be at the top. Also, I walked past you when I didn't mean to. Get a bunch of arrows rain down on you. Arrows rain down on you again. Blast you up and cover you in water. can't be the boss of the area. This is way too easy to be the boss. This did not take much effort for this mission at all. We didn't even take half of the area. 
They wouldn't just make an entire area and only make you go halfway up it. Wait, Goron Captain, what's wrong? Come on, break your defense. Almost got you, Darunia. Just fall already, I wanna get some answers. Just in case this does in fact uh, end it, I wanna kill some of these guys here. I once again meant to do that on Darunia. Failed again. I also leveled up. Fantastic. Now I'm level 18, the same as Link was at the end of this thing. Defeated Darunia. What? And we're just gonna let him get away? Oh, okay, temporarily retreated. Alright, that's cool. Rain down upon you. Rain down upon you as well. I love how many of them I can kill with that attack. It just feels good. Got you guys, not very many, but enough to deal heavy damage to that Goron Captain. Boom! Oh, come on, that didn't kill you? Runia, you're back already? That's some crazy strength. Get you all. Where's the gold skull tool on this one? Oh. That was immediate. That's not what that was. Okay, I think the gold skull tool is probably south from me, so I'll head there in just a moment. Don't tell me it's up there. Please don't tell me it's up there. Yes, I get it's about to fall. I'm trying to find... It's up there. There's not even a doubt about that in my mind that they'd put it up there, so I can't get it. No gold skull tool for me. What I can get is a bunch of dead enemies. Battling Gorm forces? Oh, that feels good. Being blocked. You're in the middle of your. Gotcha. Boom! Oh, come on, you cannot block something that powerful. Come on, that should be powerful enough to beat you already. Gotcha. 
defeated Daruni again. Okay, got back the boulder keeps. I got back one of them. Actually, I was going the right way. And you head down here. I'm just annoyed I can't even get the freaking thing. The, uh, Gold's Gold one? Wait, what the? Oh, it opened up the captain. Got you. Come on, I just need a small uh, magic potion. So I can just use my ability because I don't want to use that other magic potion, the full thing. It'd be a waste to do it right now. Beat this outpost captain. I'm making my way up town. I've killed so many of them, though. And that's a good feeling. That's not a great feeling. Because I'm kind of killing a bunch of Gorons, so it's like, uh, well, that kind of sucks. But I am doing uh, really well in this. Though I am a bit overleveled. So, you know. Pick your poison. Being overleveled or not doing very well. Obviously, I'm not very good at game. Got you. Got more SP. Even stop that bomb chip. Now, back the way I was coming. I'm gonna come back here and grab some stuff. Because I have plenty of time on my hands. I'm just kind of annoyed that I lost the uh, gold school class. <sighs> With all those, I'm just gonna have to show off where they are. I'll come back here between them when I have the ability to. I'm just... It bums me out that I can't do those right now. I just realized how bad we're doing on that side. I need to get down here and help. Got that material, and now keep helping over here. Oh, hey, we're sending bomb juice. That's cool. <laughs> Got you all. Bomb shoe has entered allied base. Where? What? No, it didn't. I was here! No, we don't! I was... I was... Okay, guys. Well, I'm gonna do this once per video, aren't I? Run past Daruni up here, and instead head up here to try to cut them off. Huh? I need to kill that bomb chew right now and defeat it before it defeats the base again. Hey, bomb chew! Of the dead. Now I can head down and try to beat that one there. 
What do you mean? Are you kidding me? Twice? I think it expects me to be down there when it's... Fine, I guess I'll head straight down there. That's... Dumb! Oh. A bunch who spawns here? Got all of you in that attack. I think I beat the bomb to beat it. Beat the bomb to uh, operator. I just can't believe they put one way down here. I was past that at this point. Hey, bomb chew. Okay, we got a bomb chew. There we go, guys. Now we shouldn't have the issues we were having before. Apparently, they spawned in the bottom areas as well. So when I was up top already, yeah, they were somehow spawning down here. Get all of you in this attack. Boom. I'm one of 20 already. Ow. The West Goron Keep is in danger of falling. Don't care. Bomb shoes are advancing again. Apparently. Um, I'm just gonna run up here and use max attack. No real reason to even worry about it. Bomb shoes has reached the East Keep. Huh, you're dead. Gotcha. Control the East Keep. Don't care that much. What I do care about is toy annihilating you. Now that that host captain is gone, I can get his material. I can head back in here and get full, uh, special power, uh, bar increase. Uh, let's see. Yep, old rupees. By the way, as you might notice, I'm extremely low in rupees. I'm only down to 4k when I was up to, like, 16,000 before. That's because I used them all to level up, uh, Impa before the thing. I know I mentioned I leveled up, I just don't think I've even mentioned how you can level people up. Got you. Wait, what? Are you kidding me? But that was our bomb. Ch I'm done. Uh, you're kidding me. So I'm not even going to... Apparently, I'm not even supposed to try to make my way up the mountain at this point. I'm supposed to sit in the base, kill anyone who comes near. Because that's apparently my role at this point. Alright. Cut you to pieces. This is my last resort. Okay, I got one of the bomb shoes right off the bat because I had a full thing. Wait, what do you mean it's still moving? Bomb 2 Operator's not dead? But he was in a blast! If 
finally! I don't think it recognized the fact I had killed it yet, because it didn't it didn't even know what I was supposed to do. Oh come on. Come on, the bomb chew should not be able to go without its master. Stop! Stop hitting me in the back, you jerks! Got you, you stupid dicks. Finally got all of you taken care of. Level up. Now I'm level 20 again, right as I take this place again. Killed a Goron captain. Good night. That should be mine. What do you mean it's f You're kidding me. Wait, you just didn't even succeed in protecting it, Sheik. Okay. I need to defeat Darunia, but that doesn't mean much when I can't even... I can't even. East Keep Mountain is about to fall. Doesn't matter that much to me. What does matter to me is the fact that I am in serious danger if I don't figure something out here. Because apparently, while I was off fighting the war, Sheik wasn't really doing much. Got ya. And the bomb shoes here, so I lose. Because no one else can deal damage like I do. Oh, it didn't fall this time. Got you. What do you mean I captured those? I didn't even get near them. Did they all come? No wonder we were taking such damage. All the captains from every nearby base came to our base. That's stupid of them. It obviously was working, but it was stupid of them. You know what? Screw it. I don't care. Oh, that looks... Sweet! Oh my gosh, that feels good. I'm gonna go kill that, uh, bomb chew guy again. Bomb chew operator, that's what they're called. 
Let's see the control of the bomb chew. Got you. Boom! The West Forum. Oh, that's way up there. I don't even have to worry about that. That was just to keep them at bay. Bombchu has reached the Chief's room. Nice. Got you. Just as we planned. I wonder how much reached the East Keep already. I'm loving how we're taking control of things. All I all you have to do is A control all the bomb chews, B make sure your base doesn't die. Which I guess is normal, but it's like Sheik was not able to handle the three captains that came by. Which sucks, but you know. Can't really fault him. The allied base is in danger again. I'm gonna head in there, I'm gonna see whether I can help or not. I should be able to help, considering the fact that I'm freaking powerful and actually decent at combos and things. How do you get more allied... That's not close to being beaten. That's not close to being beaten at all. That's the material. Okay, I need to go to the west. East Boulder Keep has fallen, which means I need to actually head east. That sucks. I'll have to be up there in a minute. Suffer damage from a boulder. Yes, all at once, all those things happen. This is actually a legitimately difficult one, not even because it's like with a bunch of enemies, it's because it's constantly one thing after another. Yes, I get the fact that it's in danger. You don't have to repeat it five times in a row. I'm just going to beat you all. I'm trying. Give me a moment. Gotcha. East Border Keep is mine. Okay. Now I can take you down. Make my progress upwards. Alright, I don't care about the remaining Gorons there. I do care about clearing you out. To make way for my guys. Seriously. They did a good job making this extremely difficult. Because even though I'm powerful, I'm having to micromanage everything at once. And one thing ex that's extremely useful is the fact that the rupees are now auto pickup in this game, which is nice. Sheik defeated Goron Captain. Just go unleashed mode here. Bomb shoes reached the East Goron Keep. Immediately got it. Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay, got more of that magic. I don't have a lot of time to play around here.
I just need to take control of everything at once. That'll actually pretty much do it for me. And then I'll just have to worry about the chief's room. Grab that material one here. And now head over here. Got all of you. And we instantly got this area thanks to the bomb tree that was already sitting here. So that's a good strategy, guys. If you want to, you can just attack a place that has a bomb shoe in it, and you immediately get it if you kill the uh, guy who controls it. And now that we control the entire map, whoops, well, not the entire map, I guess, we have to kill this, these areas. Let's run through here real quick. Hey, Darunia. Big Poe was discovered at the Chief's room. Ooh. I'm killing you. I don't even care. Big Poe. Thank you. Oh my gosh, that felt good. You feed the Big Poe, Drunia's power is decreased. Oh, that was actually a thing I had to do? Defeat Drunia, return to sanity. Oh, okay. Like I thought, he was totally insane. <laughs> so the only area I don't control is directly above the ally keep, which doesn't really matter to me. I actually want to come up here first, though. Because I see a captain type enemy. And I want his uh, material. Alright, Darunia. So oh, come on! Did I hit you? Come on, I have to. I had to have hit you, right? Not that I really needed that. Ow. I know that's the same attack you keep using. I mean, I keep falling for it. Gotcha. Come on. Guard when you're weak? That's complete BS. Gotcha. Darunia. I'm gonna kill your men real quick. Ooh, actually. I think I'm gonna finish you off with one of these. Drinia. You ready? Finally we're gonna get you with one of these. And we control everything. Well, besides that one area, but it doesn't really matter. Thank you, Darunia. Thank you for finally giving up. That took 45 minutes. That took 45 freaking minutes. Hey, Princess Rudo. Hi, Rudo. Yeah. I see that you have actually something clothing wise now. Well, I guess that's actually part of. Hmm. I'm not sure how I feel about the fish tits. Ignoring that! Victory finally! Man, that was strenuous. But we finally did it. 
Oh man, that was a lot. That was taxing. But well worth it. We got back up to 18,000 rupees. Bigron's knife, a sword created by the finest Goron smithy who ever lived. It slices deeper, requires immense strength to wield. Press the strong attack button quickly dash into enemies. 150 attack. It's nice. Also, we got the goddess sword, which I don't even know what that ability is. And a fire rod. Thick Goron's helmet, Goron armor breastplate, big po necklace, and 39 rocks. You can now battle as Darunia. Magic Hammer. Special Hammer for during his use only. Use the strong attack button to charge his enemies. Hit an enemy to walk onto the enemy, allowing you to follow up with more strong attacks. You're in the Marathon Man Metal. It dashed a total of 42.195 kilometers or more. I don't know why exactly that amount. I'll look into that. Posting to Meverse. Man, this takes a while. Oh, that's fine. A new historical entry is now available. Darunia, Goron Chief. A new histor historical entry is available. Rudo, Thor Princess. Man, I can't speak. So guys, next time on Let's Play Hyrule Warriors, we're going to be getting in back into this. I think we're going to be pulling as Darunia next time, so that should be interesting. So guys, we'll, we'll meet back here at Lake Hylia. See you guys then. Is that the boss of Skyward Sword that I'm going to have to fight? So let's jump straight in. One thing I've noticed that I haven't been getting is heart pieces. I decided to do a little look up. They're just hidden everywhere, so I haven't been searching enough.